Hey everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to stop your AirPods from automatically switching between your Apple devices like your iPhone, iPad or Mac. If your AirPods keep jumping from one device to another when you don't want them to, don't worry, this quick fix will help you. Auto switching is an AirPods feature Apple introduced to make life easier. When you're wearing your AirPods and start playing media on another device, they will switch over automatically. While it is useful for some, it can be super annoying when your AirPods switch devices when you don't want them to. Here's how to turn it off on your iPhone or iPad. Connect your AirPods to your iPhone and launch the settings app. Here you can either tap on the AirPods name from the top or tap on the Bluetooth option. Find your AirPods in the list of Bluetooth devices and tap on the I button next to them. Then tap on the connect to this iPhone option. On the next page, Change it from automatically to when last connected to this iPhone. That's it. Now your AirPods will only connect to your iPhone when they were last connected to it. No more random switching. If you're also using a Mac, here's how to stop auto switching there too. Make sure your AirPods are connected to your Mac. Then open system settings. If you're using an older version of macOS, then open system preferences. Click on the Bluetooth option. Next. Find your AirPods and click on the Options button next to them. Now look next to connect to this Mac. Here choose when last connected to this Mac option instead of automatically. And that's it. Now your Mac won't hijack your AirPods without your permission. Here's a bonus tip. If you're signed into the same Apple ID on multiple devices, your AirPods are going to be aware of all of them. So turning off auto switching on each device individually is the best way to avoid interruptions. And that's how you stop your AirPods from switching devices automatically. Super easy, right? If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more iPhone tips and tricks. Got any questions? Drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.